Okay guys, so we're gonna do a sit down chit chat video and you guys are just gonna be like, wow Sydney, why are you just throwing this at us? I'm gonna do a little update. Um, and then I'm gonna do like a full like sit down, like I'm actually have my shit together type video pretty soon as well. But today's just gonna be a chit chat because I, I need to talk to you guys. And I feel like it's important to like get through the whole experience so you guys can see what it's really like to be a college student. And I feel like it's really important to like be able to document this and like the camera is like my best friend you guys are my best friends so it's easy to talk and not feel like i'm just talking to a wall you know like i feel like i'm actually talking to you guys and the first thing is number one i love being an exercise and wellness major the only downfall that just made me so unhappy was the anxiety and the stress i was getting and the fact that I wasn't taking care of myself and the reason why I want to like talk about this is because like I'm switching my major and it's going into communications I have no idea if I'm gonna even still stay in college but I really don't want to walk out of you know doing college and just not have a degree like I am determined to have a degree um so yeah my mom thinks I'm gonna drop out she's like really freaked out right now probably mom if you're watching this I'm sorry but um I like freaked her out because like I was talking about dropping out and she was like no don't and my mom's a college graduate my dad's over here like do what you want to do he hasn't graduated college but today I just got off a advising appointment and I really really feel like I need to get a degree and I think a degree is really important but when you're your own boss which I am um, with my marketing agency that I haven't really talked to you guys about like what I do I've picked up so many clients and I'm really excited for it because I feel like it's something that I'm really passionate about and I've been doing for a long time but I never like did it to the best of my abilities and now I'm finally doing that and I just want to make sure I still get my degree and I think it's important to have a degree because when you're 40 and you know maybe things don't pan out or something like that like you have that degree but the 12 foundations of wealth which is what Ty Lopez um which he calls it the 12 foundations is something that's super important as well so it's health wealth love and happiness those are the four main things and there's three things like under each which is why it's the 12 foundations and you know I've been really unhappy I've had a lot of anxiety and I just my statistics class I have a 48 percent in that class and when I tell you guys I've been trying so hard in that class anyone who's taken statistics and passed it successfully worked their ass off to pass it like and maybe there's some people that like got it really easily but most people that I've talked to that have passed that class say it's really hard and I was working so hard to pass that class but when your learning style is different than your professor's learning style it's really hard to do the class pass the stuff and so like what I decided was I'm just gonna I'm just gonna like I'm not gonna pass now she literally told me she was like earlier in the year she, or earlier in the semester she was like it's gonna be magic that'll make you pass so I was like okay I'm gonna work my ass off I'm gonna really just push it until she says I'm not gonna pass like until she like has to tell me like you're you have no hope like I'm just gonna keep working really hard I'm gonna go into her office hours like I did I'm just gonna keep trying so I did and then to this morning I woke up I had my advising appointment to be a communications major already and that's at the Tempe campus and then I saw my grade and I got an a 29% and the average for this exam was 48% so it wasn't like I know there's people that got way like lower grades than even I got but I thought I had at least gotten a 70 or a 60 like at least and I was pretty confident that like I was gonna be able to pass this course but I got that my grade plummeted by like t like 15% 12% or whatever and I realized okay this is kind of my thing I emailed her asked her do you think I'm gonna pass and she said no you just need to withdraw um, but I can't withdraw because I have scholarship and so I'm just talking to you guys about this because I feel like you guys need to know statistics is a class you need to have time for do not take too many classes and think you will pass when you're like spreading yourself too thin like I was um, and make sure that like in the beginning it might seem easy but as the time goes on it's going to get harder um, same with my sciences I realized that like I was not gonna be happy because I was just getting so stressed my anxiety was so high like thinking about these classes let alone being in them I dropped my chemistry class because um, all of my courses were just so 
so hard this semester and I was just doing things that and it wasn't making me happy so I dropped that but I put I'm pushing through stats but I'm not actually pushing through because like she literally told me she was like you're not gonna pass so there's no point in even doing it and so that's kind of where I'm at if that tells you something so I'm switching to communications but I'm gonna probably be getting my minor or certificate in exercise and wellness in some way shape or form or kinesiology because I really feel like it's important that I do that because I'm telling you guys all about health and wellness but I'm putting my health and wellness on the back burner and Ty Lopez like I said again I was watching a thing last night and he said that like the way the key to being happy and having like a great life is the four foundations the foundation of health wealth love and happiness and there's Michaela it's, it's fine it's just a sit down vlog okay you're fine like I'm not editing any of it but um the main four like platforms to it is health wealth love and happiness and like I have the love in my life right now I have amazing friends I have a boyfriend which is like so unheard of for me <laughs> just kidding <laughs> a serious boyfriend if that tells you something and then um, I have a decent relationship with my family right now like right now it's kind of strained because of like all these things that I'm dropping on them because like, they're kind of stressed um, but my health is on the back burner my wealth is doing pretty well like my income right now is pretty good but like that income doesn't make you happy neither does just having one aspect of all these four different foundations so i was like all right my happiness is gone and my health is gone like i need to get these back and i realized i'm not going to get them back being stressed having high anxiety and just like canceling on people that i genuinely want to see so i realized you know becoming a communications major is probably going to be the best thing for me i'm going to test the classes out i'm going to take some summer classes to get caught up um and i'm going to try and graduate maybe a semester early too if i possibly can but the goal is to still get my degree um i'm switching majors never thought i'd say that but because i'm very set on like being exw and that's why so many people were like shocked when they found out i'm switching but at the same time i feel like communications can help me um i'm gonna get an emphasis and be on the track of I think it's like leadership or something and I met with my advisor like on the phone like we talked and we picked up the classes so now my next step is I'm gonna be taking uh, two classes I think for community college and I'll still be able to work I'll still be able to travel um, for part of it but they'll be a little accelerated and then I will be at Tempe campus next year which is gonna be a totally different thing so you guys are gonna see Tempe campus videos at that point which is gonna be weird I'm gonna try and get some classes downtown if I possibly can because I feel like um, Tempe classes are they have a lot more options a lot more seats but if I can be closer to home because my house is so close to downtown I'm gonna try um, but yeah so I met with my advisor and she's changing my major and like I have a new advisor now her name's Carol she's super nice but yeah so that's kind of like my little update I just want to let you guys know that Michaela's here now um, we're gonna be going she's actually going to be helping me today we're gonna be going to a client uh, I have a client meeting she's gonna be coming with and look I'm even wearing Nikes like, yeah I'm look at shoes like, so I don't know if you guys know this but I do marketing for a lot of different industries and companies but one of the ones that I'm doing today is for nine round fitness which um, it's just called nine round it's a kickboxing thing and she might be working out today who knows but she's coming with to do my snaps and stuff <laughs> If I do, it's a miracle. Yeah, if I can convince her. But then, um, I, I'm i wearing this. And, yeah. But, like, I really just want to get my health and my happiness back on track. Because I feel like I'm just not happy where my life's at. And I know that I need to make a shift. And I need some personal development. And some, like, obviously education. Um, whether I'm self-educating or I'm educating through a university, I think both are really important. I feel like self-education is where you really grasp it and learn it and keep it. But I feel like also doing this would be good. So, yeah. I don't know how to tell you guys anything else, but I really hope this helps you guys. If you guys are struggling with this as well, um, I hope that this helps. But I'm going to keep doing updates randomly if you guys like these. Um, kind of like explaining the whole process of changing majors and yeah so I love you guys very much and I'll talk to you guys in my next video and yeah April I'm gonna still be uploading almost daily once summer hits May I'm gonna be uploading amazing content once again and I'll just be working really hard and um 
yeah i'll be at tempe campus next semester though so if you guys are there say hi but with that being said i love you guys so much thank you for watching and you guys are literally the best love you guys bye